but we in it shall be remembered. We few, we happy few, we band of brothers, for he today that sheds his blood with me shall be my brother. Be he ne'er so vile, this day shall gentle his condition. And gentlemen in England now abed shall think themselves accursed they were not here, and hold their manhoods cheap, while any speaks that fought with us upon St. Crispin's Day! Ah! My sovereign lord, restore yourself with speed. French are bravely in their battle set, and will with all expedience charge on us. All things are ready, if our minds be so. Once more I come to know of thee, King Harry. Before thy ransom thou wilt now compound before thy most assured overthrow. For certainly, thou art so near the gulf, thou needs must be in glutted. Besides, in mercy the constable desires thee thou wilt mind thy followers of repentance, that their poor souls may make a peaceful and a sweet retire from off these fields where wretched, their poor bodies must lie and fester. Who hath sent thee now? The constable of France. I pray thee bear my former answer back. Tell the constable, we are but warriors for the working day. Our gayness and our guilt are all besmirched with rainy marching in the painful field, and time hath worn us into slovenry. But by the mass our hearts are in the trip. Harold, save thou thy labor. Come thou no more for ransom, gentle Harold. I shall have none, I swear. But these, my joints, which if they have, as I will leave them, them shall yield them little. Tell the constable. I shall, King Harry. And so fare thee well. Thou never shalt hear Harold any more. Now, soldiers, march away, and how thou pleasest God, dispose the dead. Ah! 